Ladies, what's up, what's up, what's up, what's up? So I'm gonna show you guys some plant-based pro cleaning products that I literally just picked up from, from Target. I tell you, I just walked in the door, I literally just walked back through the door and I was so freaking amped and I was like, you know what, I'm about to do like a little mini haul and show Chin Gang all the new cleaning products that I got because I'm so excited. I never thought people could get this excited over cleaning products, but I don't know what the heck is going on with me, <laughs> but... I'm so excited. When I tell you, no exaggeration, I must have spent about 45 minutes in the cleaning aisle. I'm not kidding. Like, literally, I spent about 45 minutes just so intrigued and doing my research, you know, going on Google while I'm in the aisle and looking at these products and seeing, you know, the ingredients and all this stuff. So I usually use Clorox to do my everyday cleaning, like my bathroom, you know, the kitchen, Ajax with the bleach. I actually just bought a new one, but I'll tell you about that in a little bit. So I use the Ajax because I use that on my stove because I do find that the Clorox doesn't really get the stains out and the Ajax does. So if you've been following me for a while, then you know that I've mentioned before about switching over to everything being plant-based. And let me tell you something really quick. Like, I'm not rushing the process, you know what I'm saying? I'm just letting nature take its course. You know, I'm, I don't push things, I just let things flow naturally. So it's kind of funny that I said that before, and then all of a sudden I just went to Target today. I'm going to tell you how it actually started. While I was here, before I went to Target, I was, um, you know, I, was, I think I needed some hand sanitizer. And something told me, I was like, you know what? I don't know what it was, guys. It was like the most weirdest thing. But I just put the hand sanitizer on, and I'm like, man, this just just smells so like alcoholic like you know what i'm saying like so strong with chemicals and that was just so crazy because i was just more like conscious of it and automatically i was just like all right i'm gonna try to find a plant-based um hand sanitizer and that's this is so this is what brings us here right now okay you know when you are so used to and normalized to use these things you're not really paying attention because it's just a part of it's just been a part of you you know what i'm saying you're just so used to it so now that i'm you know getting a little bit on a different um i guess awareness level you know like all of this stuff is really starting to change right? well, the hand sanit this hand sanitizer wasn't from target i stopped in at the um korean mark one no yeah i stopped in at one of the asian markets around my house because i wanted to get a green juice so while i was getting the green juice and i was checking out these were right at the front and it's just so crazy because look i was just saying i want a hand sanitizer right and look how the universe just put it right in front of my face like four dollars and 79 cents and at first i was like you know i was gonna put it off and i was like eh let me just get it because I literally was just saying that I wanted new hand sanitizer, so I just picked it up. Never even really sprayed it or anything yet, but this is by Mistress Myers Clean Day, and this is the basil scent. On the back here, it says, made with aloe vera extract, glycerin, made without parabens. And so yeah, I really don't know much about this brand. This is actually my first time buying anything by them, but by the looks of things it definitely seems to be a little bit more on the calmer side and when i say calmer you know like not um too much alcohol too much chemicals or whatever i don't know but um i'm gonna try it out and i'll you know i'm gonna see how i like it i actually wrote down that i wanted to try a plant-based deodorant as well but this one actually i don't know it doesn't say plant-based this is tom's of Maine coconut lavender as deodorant for women 24 hour witness protection okay so it says active ingredients aluminum chlorhydrate 22 percent has coconut oil soybean oil it's castor oil so it has a couple things in here but it doesn't actually state if it's on um, plant-based I'm not too familiar with reading the ingredients, but that's something that's going to come along. You're not expected to know everything. That's why it's important to always do research. I'm definitely going to research, you know, more about ingredients in these products. But for right now, just, you know, I just want to make the shift. Once I make the shift, that is a start to me. That I'm going to try this out and it smells really good. I actually tried it in Target. as a coconut scent. Once again, it's going to be a lot more gentle on the body than the regular deodorants. All right. So I wasn't intending on getting all of these products and maybe like five things that I had to pick up and somehow I ended up spending freaking almost 60 bucks. 
but <laughs> it is what it is i was like you know what i didn't want to leave anything behind i just really wanted to try these out it's okay to test them out and kind of see which one because I'm sure that I'm not going to like all of them. I mean, it's possible. I'm just going to test them out and see which ones I really like. So next time I know when they run out, I know, all right, boom, I'm going to just go and I'm going to just grab this or grab that. You know what I'm saying? Now, let's talk about the sixth generation brand. If you've been keeping up with my vlogs, you know, the last... Um, probably like a month or two months ago a vlog that I was telling you guys that um I started using the seven generation tampons as I love it so far the only brand in Target that I actually saw with the plant-based applicator and also the organic cotton so I was really surprised when I actually saw seven generation and when I usually go to Target I always just see set on um, the ever spring and I never saw this one maybe because I just wasn't really looking it seems to me that seven generation is expanded their brand I was really surprised that they had all these things they have cleaning products they have laundry detergent they have these softeners they also have have candles they have like spray you know like air fresheners like plant-based air fresheners it's just like crazy how much stuff they have so i definitely want to go back and get some more of the stuff on in their lines so this is the all-purpose cleaner that i decided to try out it is scents from 100 percent essential oils and botanicals ingredients and it's the fresh morning meadow scent and the ingredients is on here i'm not going to go over that right now but i'm just going to tell you that it's gluten-free a lot of plant-based cleaning agents are in here as well if you want more information you can always google it i decided to try the deter the laundry detergent i'm actually doing laundry tomorrow so that's one of the reasons why i went to target today because i wanted to buy i was going to buy a detergent i usually use the tide and when i looked over i saw this one i said oh crap it smells okay it, they had difference they had another scent too they had the citrus one but i don't want citrus on my clothes um so i decided to get this one um this fabric softener because this one doesn't really have a scent and the fabric softener is lavender has a lavender scent which is great so you know after the clothes is a wash you know and then you put this in the you know the sheets these are sheets by the way so you're gonna throw put these in the in the dryer so i figured all right that's good enough for my clothes to have a nice smell i just didn't want the citrus i didn't really like the way that the citrus detergent smells so that's why i decided to just go with these two it's the seventh generation powered by plants zero percent synthetic fragrances 0% dyes and 0% artificial brightness. So this is the fabric softener sheets. This is 80 of them that comes in here. Oh, I forgot to tell you all the prices. I'm sorry. This was, um, hold on, it's up here. Oh, it was $4.99. The deodorant was $4.99. And the fabric softener was $4.99 as well. The detergent was $10.90. 10.99 yeah this is 10.99 and guys this is so crazy because you would think these stuff is more a little bit more pricier than the regular one absolutely not this was 10.99 and the tie that i was going to get before um oh and this is 66 lows the tide one i was going to get okay wow that's crazy because the tide one i was going to get was 60 um 64 loads for $12 I think $12.99 something like that so wow this is definitely about $2 cheaper you get more loads and it's plant-based um okay so this one says 97% plant-based sheets zero synthetic fragrances and this is the lavender fragrance and it smells good smells really good okay now I also needed a glass cleaner so I was going to get the Windex but <laughs> I saw this one. I always see the Ever Spring, and I said, you know what? Let me give it a try. Um, and also, what I did realize that this also this all-purpose cleaner, which I can use, you know, to clean down after I finish um, washing the dishes. I could use to like clean off here, you know, like any little surfaces. I could use this. And when I was reading it, I realized that it also did say you could use it for on the glass. And I was really shocked. And I was like, that's why I was like, hmm, 
should I just get one of these? But then, um, I like the fact that this says streak free shine because I love my glass, like my mirrors when in bath in my bathroom and also in my room. I like them to be really, really clean and spotless. So this is what really gra I gravitated towards streak free shine. So I was like, that's why I was like, you know what? Let me just grab both of them. Whatever it is, what it is. So I'm going to use this um, on my glasses, on my mirrors. So this says 90% bio based product. I also googled that while I was in um while i was in target and because i really didn't know what that meant and because this doesn't say plant-based you know but i guess it is a plant-based product but it just didn't say it and it also says not tested on animals and biodegradable formula bio base is kind of like just google it guys it was kind of confusing i'm gonna do more research on it but um, yeah, so I decided to go ahead and give this one a try. Non-toxic, 100% natural fragrance. And then this is just a Mistress My another Mistress Myers um, clean day multi-surface everyday cleaner. So instead of like the Clorox, once again, I'll be using this to clean off any surface areas. It says remove dirt, freshens um, surfaces. This is the lemon scent, and they did have a. I saw three other different scents, the same exact product here, but I decided to just go with the lemon ones. And it says plant de derived ingredients, natural essential oils, burk bark extract, parabens, and fellas free blah, 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 all that yeah and yeah so i'm really excited to try this because i'm not gonna lie guys like i started to really notice how strong these things are especially the clorox with the bleach when i'm you know cleaning the bathroom it's extremely strong i paid i was aware of it one time and i was like holy crap because when i when i went out after i was cleaning i went outside to like throw away the garbage i could just smell how strong it was once you leave from where you are inside and you go out into fresh air that cannot be healthy for us at all it was so strong and it lingered and you're breathing in that you know all that toxic chemical so i had to you know get something that's a little bit more natural last but not least oh crap <laughs> all right last but not least is this seventh generation a disinfecting bathroom cleaner kills 99.99% of germs and kills cold and flu viruses. I saw two of them. They had another one there. But this one was uh, like basically all in one. So I was like, okay, let me go with this one. It has lemongrass, citrus scent. I've been getting a lot of citrus, right? <laughs> and lemon, lemony scent. I don't know. Lemon just really freshens up the area, I think. So that's the reason why I went with them. I really want something that's comparable to the Ajax that I can get as an alternative because I'm not going to lie. I really it don't. It's going to be kind of difficult for me to just totally get rid of the Ajax because like I said, especially, you know, to clean the stove. This is the only thing that really, really cleans and makes everything so spotless. I'm going to do my research and I'm going to see if I can find something that's similar to this that's more like plant based. Little by little, I think I'm going to eventually change like my my bath washes. I'm going to definitely be using more natural bath washes as well. I did see that Shea Butter do have, um, Shea Moisture, I said Shea Butter, <laughs> Shea Moisture does have um, natural bath washes and also face washes and moisturizers. Oh, and hand soap. I did see the 7th generation hand soap as well. Eventually, I'm just going to switch up every single thing. I just want everything to be a bit, bit more softer because all that chemical, I know for a fact, is not good for us, our body. We're breathing it in and it's just too much. You know what I'm saying? So, eventually, everything is going to change. This is just a start. Oh, and guess what they even had? I saw candles and they smelled pretty good i mean candles i don't really know if i'm gonna switch you know if it's something that i really want to switch over to who knows who knows what the future holds it's just an option just oh and they also have plugins guys how cool is that they have plant-based plugins so i definitely want to go back and try those i'm so happy that the seventh generation is you know expanding and i'm just so excited to try the products and to see if they're really good quality and they actually work because that's the thing you want what you're buying to work right so that's pretty much it that is all that i just got i just really wanted to do a quick little haul if you have any more suggestions or what i should try out any brands it could be anything just let me know 
down in the comments. And until the next video, I will see you all again. Peace. She back for good.